Three, five, one, two, one. Three, five, one, two, one. One, two, one. Look at your wristband. Look down, focus. Three, five, one, two, one. Is anybody out there? Three, five, one, two, one. Again, barely used. Adam, how happy to be back here. Uh, one, this is essentially like your home track. OSW, you love this place. You're back behind the saddle. And you got big Mustangs to fill, bro. After the boss man and takes the win in Atlanta. I'm really excited. I love the track. I got to drive a lot of bank tracks last year. The car feels great. Looks great in home track. It's always a good vibe. Awesome. All right. Three, five, one, two, one. Anybody? Anybody? All right. Somebody's moving quick back there. I don't know if that's media or what's going on, but all right. We'll park that. Thank you, Adam. We'll find out who gets that thing. And then finally, Chelsea Denofa's trunk. Oh, man. Chelsea, hold that up there, buddy. I know. It is like... <laughs> I, I get it. Uh, it uh, just a little... Regina, can you tell me, tell me on the doll where they hurt you, Chelsea. Where do where they hurt you? The wall hurt me right here. And the wall hurt my best friend. It hurt me like that. All right, do you have the number? Do you know who wins this thing? Do you have the number? Get over here. I remember it. 35046. 35046? 35046. Is that what it is? 046. 35046. Anybody? Anybody? So again, 121046. All right, 046. Check out your wristband. Again, look down. It says 35046. Anybody got it? Three five zero four six. Nobody. All right. Who who drove here the furthest? Where did you come from? Detroit. That's pretty far. Where'd you drive from? California. Yo, come on, little man. I, I've seen this dude. Come on. Do we give it to him and his family? I know they. Come on. There we go. Mini eco beast right there. Him and his. You want to sign it? That's bigger than you, bro. Him and his family come out to Formula Drift. We saw them at, uh, at Long Beach. He comes out to Nitro Cross races. He's at Hot Wheels events. So, obviously, so who, which one of your siblings are you putting on the roof so you can bring that home now? Don't name names. You're not supposed to answer. Over here so you can fit it. Imagine trying to check this thing. <laughs> exactly. All right. So, uh, again, thank you guys and gals. We'll find out if those vendors, we, yeah, Adam. Adam says you don't want me to call anybody, so why not? Let's. Uh, which guy? Oh, that right there. That dude. You want this vendor? Yeah, you. I feel like you guys are like dating right now. Me? Me? You guys? Tell me I'm pretty. Tell me I'm pretty. That's your vendor, dog. High five. Do you want to sign in or anything, or you just want to look at him awkwardly? Oh, good. Congrats, dog. You look at. It must be the beard. It's the beard for sure. I see it. It's good. It's good. I like beards too, obviously. All right. We got one more. Von Gittin Jr., everybody, make some noise. Come on. All right. What's going on, everybody? Thank you all so much for coming out. This is unreal. Uh, three, five, nine, seven, five. Three, five, nine, seven, five. Four, A. 500, is that right? Yeah, dude. $500 RTR gift card. 35975. Again, everybody should have 35 up front and then 975 on the back end. So 975, it might be down in the bathroom because it takes like a half a day to get down there. 975, what do you think, Juan? What do you think? I think we're just gonna have to pull an olive oil on this one. Omaha? What are we got? Last call. 35975. Anyone going once? Going twice. Alright. Okay, here we go. So, what we so okay, so collect our thoughts. Got another number here. 35975. What do we got? Alright, here we go. You guys ready? I'm gonna rattle these off. 35098. Zero nine eight. Going once. Gone. Three zero one. Going once. Gone. Where did these numbers come from? 186. 186. Going once. 621. Clearly. What? 621? Do we have 621 here? 621. Hey! Hey, so look like that's, that's 500 bucks and a slide bag. There we go. 
Mothers against verbal tunes, by the way. That's there we go. So again, Bongin Jr., the history here, started in 2010, RTR. Thank you so much for joining us here. But I know Bon loves to give back, man. With Fun Haver, RTR, some carbon fiber trophies, you know, the RTRC, the RTRX, but we got one more bag. One more goodie bag, you know what? I'm just gonna throw it. But don't hurt any babies. Like if there's any babies or dogs around you, be mindful. It is easier. It's easier. Here we go. Alright? Ready, go. So throw it there. Be careful. Oh gosh. Oh, there's a, oh gosh. Yo, my man's been to punk shows. Good job. <laughs> it always blows my mind what people will do for a piece of cotton. All right, so uh, so Vaughn, we've had some technical difficulties, a little bit of electricity issues. Obviously, you see the weather. It's been uh, been a little violent. Dude, flying in here was wild. It was about as wild as you're driving in Atlanta last round of Formula Drift. This guy makes some noise. Vaughn, a little bit of technical issues. We got we got videos playing. We got things going. They're gonna watch that later on uh, on the grams. I think we've got the video. So yeah, technical issues. Shout out to the whole RTR team for making this happen. It's, Orlando weather has not been uh, working out for us. Thank you all for coming out, despite the rain. I know you all are from Florida, most of you, so you're like, rain? Yeah, every day. But uh, anyway, uh, we've, we've done the best we can to improvise. Uh, we're going to queue up a video. You guys ready to see this machine that we have been working extremely hard on? And uh, hope you guys are really seen it. We got our entire drift team here, Adam, Chelsea, James. Cletus even came out. And uh, yeah, I feel, I'm feeling the love and I'm really grateful for you guys. Uh, Lindsay, our lead designer is here. He's gonna come up and chat once we unveil the car. Uh, we'll do a couple photos with the team and then let you guys kind of have at it for a bit. And then we'll uh, hang out, go meet and greet, take photos. And uh, at the end, towards the end of the night, I'll walk down and anyone that wants a car sign, any photos by the car, I'll just hang out here until you guys have to leave. So uh, yeah. Rock and roll, let's uh, cue that video. Send it, come on. Since 2010, RTR's mission has been to redefine the definition of performance. Whether you're on the track, drifting, cruising back roads, drag racing, or daily driving, RTR is about much more than just driving. It's about the experience. The 2024 Ford Mustang RTR is our curated vision of what makes Mustang so great and an enhancement of its already impressive performance potential. A platform that is ready for anything, at any time, the true definition of ready to rock. The 2024 Mustang RTR hits theaters this summer. And as always, it's available to all and not for everyone. Get excited, friends. Yo, are you guys ready to see the Mustang RTR spec to 2024? Peel it back, Lindsey Von Gin Jr. The RTR is here. The all new 2024, a little wet, but guess what? She shines up good. Make some noise! The all new Ford Mustang in the flesh obviously looks great in its stock metal, it's sheet metal. But Vaughn, you and Lindsay, Lindsay get over here. Lindsay's a longtime friend of, of myself and Vaughn, an amazing designer, went to Art Center, has worked with many different manufacturers and projects. But uh, who wants to go first? Lindsay, Vaughn, talk about what the pieces are because it's, it's a collective effort here from going externally, the whole aesthetic, how it works with the you know original OEM lines, and then obviously performance. I think let's let Lindsay walk around. All right. I'm out, people. Yeah, we're good. The uh, design theme on this car is movement through space. So we start in the front, and we have these illuminated portals. Here, I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask you, all right? Here we go. I, if we got these portals that feed directly into the Kyoto V8, of course, Gen 4 Kyoto, heart and soul of this car. Every single part that we designed on the 650 is intended for a performance benefit or an efficiency benefit. So there is like no fat on this thing. We are respectful, of course, of what we are given from our amazing partners with Ford. We have 
the uh, sheet metal that we're treating as you know beautiful drapery, and then every piece of RTR that we have on here sticks forward, out, down, low, aggressive, up, back, all angles. So we are just like pushing through space and time. Yeah. So we're excited to see you guys out here, and uh, you know, how long? Like we've been sitting on this for way too long. We've been on. <laughs> Too long. Great job, Lynn. So Lindsay is a 20-year friend of mine. Long story, he's been part of the RTR family for 10, 10, 11 years now. So all the design you see, the liveries, the merch, a lot of it comes from, well, started to come from Lindsay. Now he has a team and uh, he just absolutely killed it. This is uh, the Mustang of dreams and um, you killed it on design. Like you said, super aggressive, super aggressive chin. Uh, obviously, our new RTR grill with our integrated lighting. We changed up the lighting style this year. Uh, this was very much the mindset of just taking you through, right? One step, two step, three, boom, and you're in. Uh, the rocker splitters, the rear spoiler, uh, you know, duck bill style, super sick. It even has a little Easter egg on it when you uh, when you get yours. And our new uh, Aero 5 uh, RTR wheels, of course. Wrapped in Nittos, uh, Nitto G2s, I think the favorite all around Mustang tire, good at everything, and uh, totally happy with burnouts and drifting. Um, you know, the whole mindset behind RTR is ready to rock. And that to me means ready for anything at any time. All of our Mustang spec twos have fully adjustable suspension uh, with, with respect to. Uh, shock damping as well as sway bars. So there's a chassis balance in the car for a perfectly nice ride, which is how it leaves the showroom. There's a balance in the car for having fun, hitting the back roads, doing autocross, putting sticky tires on it, hitting the road course. Of course, drifting, which is now easier than ever with the optional uh, factory performance pack vehicle comes with the electronic drift brake that myself and Chelsea Nanova helped develop with the uh, Ford engineers. And um, beyond that, uh, you know, this right here represents, in my opinion, the most fun, most progressive Mustang uh, ever built. And a big thanks to Ford for giving us such an amazing platform that makes all this fun accessible. So, uh, yeah, hope you guys like it. I cannot wait to start seeing them on the streets. They'll be out uh, in August. Uh, as soon as the new Mustang launches, uh, you go to rtrvehicles.com, check out our dealer list, or reach out to us, and we'll make sure you guys get in one. And just to add to uh, what Vaughn and, and Lindsay, I, I can just tell, obviously they're so excited, you know, just seeing this only Ford Mustang in OEM, but adorned with the RTR pieces, you know, even talking about the under tray extension, the hood vents, those are RTR, right? Because those are, those are not OEM. You talk about the rocker splitters, the rear quarter splitters, so take a look at those. The deck lid spoiler, like you said, the Easter egg. You talked about the wheels, also the shock mount kit. You got sway bars, adjustable sway bars. Also the floor mats, performance shift knob, tactical performance adjustable shocks and struts. Also the badging, you can see the RTR badging from the grill, the fenders, the deck lid. Again, that's serialized. You have dash plaque, which is signed by you, Vaughn Gittin Jr. And a certificate of authenticity, which is new for the 2024 spec too. So all this MSRP, you want to say that, rattle that off, and again, graphics package, three year, 36,000 mile warranty, for MSRP for 12495 So you get the car, and you get the RTR Spec 2 kit, and guess what, you're flossing like Vaughn Gittin Jr., Chelsea Nova, James Dean, Adam LZ, out on the streets of your track, your streets, your car show, this is RTR Spec 2. Make some noise for Vaughn Gittin Jr., Lindsay, and the RTR team. You want to invite him? Yeah, I want, I, we want to do a couple quick team photos before it gets too nuts, so if you guys can ask for your patience for a second. Uh, come on up, squad. Uh, I do want to thank you guys so much for coming out. Like, the love and support that we get on and off the track for RTR. And just gratitude to all of you. Thank you so much, for real. It's, uh, it's, it's absolutely incredible. Uh, let's go ahead and get some photos. We'll do singles, and we'll do a team photo. Yeah, please. I'd love to ask some questions of Adam, James, Chelsea, and even, even Cletus over here, because obviously uh, everybody contributes to the RTR. The RTR team expanding over the years. Again, thank you so much for joining us out here. Weather kind of dampening a little bit of the festivities, but obviously, are you guys excited? Who's, who's actually 
Who's on deck to get a 24 Ford Mustang? Come on now. Yo, right? I mean, it looks so good. I had the pleasure of announcing the debut in Detroit alongside Vaughn and some of the Ford execs. That dark horse looks me, the RTR, you know, still the EcoBoost. Hey, Vaughn, that's a great question, too. Does, does the RTR apply to the EcoBoost as well? If you say you don't get the Coyote, does it apply to the EcoBoost as well, in particular the parts that maybe won't be? Right now, we're just announcing the GT model. Uh, more news will be coming in the future for other models, but uh, right now we're announcing GT, both uh, Spec 1 as well as the Spec 2 options. Perfect, there you have it. So again, this all began in 2010. This all began in 2010. Please around. Cold rev it. Someone's got to do the cold revs around here. I'll, I got you. Did we get the photos? Are we good? Did you guys get your photos yet? All right, get on there. RTR boys. Again, this all began in 2010 with Vaughn getting junior. His mono was ready to rock. Ready to rock. It was the first year that Vaughn won the Formula Joe Championship. He wanted something different for a new generation of Ford tuning. Not just exclusive to Ford Mustangs, because the RTR can be applied to Ford Broncos, Ford Rangers. You see them in different degrees from the, the Total Fun Hammer, all the different vehicles, the RTR X, RTRC, the Fox Body, the Raptor. I know you, you got... I think I'm the only Raptor in the freaking show, dude. All right, since, so yeah, Cletus, what are you doing here, man? I know uh, you're, you're not going to be a Formula Drip, but what are you doing here, man? Have a sport Vaughn? Yeah, you know, you got to support my boy Vaughn. I got to support the whole RTR team, and, you know, I thought there was a burnout contest tonight, so I brought my Raptor, but, you know, hey, listen, I don't want to get kicked out or anything. But I wanted to see this thing, because I'm actually going to get one of these 24 Mustangs. My boy Vaughn sent me up with an RTR Mustang. And uh, it's kind of a streetcar build, though, you know? Not as spicy as the other RTR car. More of a streetcar build. So this is my first time seeing it. I pretty much already told Vaughn, pull the trigger, get me that puppy. So sooner or later, I'll have one of these. I just got to pick a color. I love it, man. Again, Cletus does such a great job, uh, you know, for, over at the Freedom Factory right here, just uh, just down the freeway a little bit. But uh, it's pretty cool, right? The RTR. What is up? What is up? Get in there. Go in there. Can't miss them. Look at this. Look at these bookend giraffes. You got an Irish giraffe, an American giraffe, and a couple of uh, Americans in the middle. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Just, just, just a few Americans. No big deal. Jake. All right, Mark. Is that a wrap? <laughs> that a wrap? <laughs> James, get on over here, buddy. Hey. Hell of an Atlanta, first time driving a Ford Mustang in Atlanta. I, I thought I went to you, some people thought so too. It was, it was a hard fought battle, but overall, Atlanta, how excited are you for so, Atlanta? Absolutely loving this journey with the RTR team, driving a brand new car, right and dry Ford Mustang, uh, RTR Spec 5 FD. It's uh, so such a new challenge for me, but I'm loving it, you know. We go to new events, new tracks, and uh, it's just learning from the first lap to the last. And Atlanta was good. I feel like we're getting closer and closer to a, a top four finish. We're definitely aiming for a podium. Hopefully it comes sooner than later. And uh, yeah, it's an absolute dream to be a part of this crazy team. Well, it's amazing just to get in here, the first back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back three-time champion. You join Chris Morsberg and, and Frederick Osbo now as of last year. But uh, what does RTR mean to you? You know, like you said, you grew up watching Von Ginn Jr., which my back hurts when you say that because it makes us feel old. But uh, what does RTR mean to you? RTR, it, it means a whole lot because I've been watching Von, as you said, from a kid and uh, seeing what he's developed um, between the, the brand, the cars, the team. It's the, it's the dream team. And uh, somehow I've ended up here. Um, I, I can't believe it still. Uh, driving a brand new car that's not even you know available to buy right now. It's it's so cool to be doing this, and uh, it's I'm just living a dream, taking every every event as it comes, and pushing as hard as possible, trying to put on a great show for the fans that come out and support not only us but everyone involved in drifting with this sport that keeps on going to new levels uh, every single event, every season. It's just it's a crazy uh, crazy dream. I think we're all living. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, James Dean. Thank you so much again. Cheer him on, James the Machine Dean. Good <laughs> one, else? Adam. Get over here. So, and what's crazy? Also, let it be noted that uh, that James Dean is driving the first right-hand drive 2024 Ford Mustang as well. So, a weapon is nothing without a, a samurai there, right? A sword. So, Adam, we saw you in Long Beach. 
Here you are, like I said, home track. We had some few words there earlier, but uh, Orlando, new, new track layout. Gonna need a lot of tire, man. That thing's almost twice as long. Look, we've got the 315 from Nitto, and they last a long time, but I think a lot of teams are gonna be struggling. Do you think they're actually gonna go through with it? Hopefully it rains is what I'm thinking. Yeah, well, it, it seems like we might get a little rain Friday, but Saturday is looking promising, so um, yeah, I don't know what's gonna happen. I just talk about it, man. I let you guys be about it. Anything else you want to add, bud? What do you think? What do you think of the spec too? I know, you know, being closer with, you know, you kind of made the debut of the the comp car on your videos. You've done such a great job of telling the story and, you know, your trials and tribulations, your successes, and, and just going through the journey, seeing this thing here, RTR spec two in, in person. No, it's awesome. I love it. It's it's clean. It's not too over the top, but it, it's subtle and it's just race car enough. I love the pearl in this color. I love the pearl in the dark horse that's coming out. And uh, I wanted to do something similar in the comp car, but we went with the blue and it's kind of inspired by a mixture of this and the dark horse. And I just think it looks so cool. I love it. Make some noise for Adam LZ. We'll see you in Orlando. High fives and handshakes. Last but definitely not least, Mr. Pizza and, and Bumper Budget. I see some of people rocking the shirts. What about Chelsea Denofa fans at? Got at least at least seven. At least well they're obviously where are my Chelsea Nova fans at? A little better. He, he look, he, your board is upside down. Hopefully you don't end up that way tomorrow or this weekend. I heard a lot of whoos. <laughs> They, they were just vaping, actually, so I guess vaped all over your face. Um, seeing this car, again, working, working with RTR over the years, you and, and I remember you coming on board at St. Louis Auto Show a few years ago and just sitting and hanging out with you guys. Just this mind share, man, from suspension to builds. Look at you guys, where you guys are at now. You, you know, the global launch, the 24 Mustang, developing the electronic drip brake. You know, I, I, I got emotional at Atlanta because Here's somebody 20 years ago who was driving, let's just call it, what is it, 240SX. It's out there, it's proof positive. And then here's Vaughn at SEMA show, the biggest banner on the building. That's a testimony to Drifting's here to stay, baby. So now you and Vaughn having access to OEM, you guys working together to develop a drift car. How crazy is that? Yeah, it's absolutely wild. The drift brake works amazing, and Ford was very, very open eyes to it and, and ready to do whatever we needed to do to make it fun when it gets into everybody else's hands. So we really got something that's how we feel it should be, and like influence a manufacturer that way is just like absolutely insane to me. Like drifting used to be like frowned upon. Oh, we don't want you to come drift at this track. Now Ford's like, hey, can you help us design a handbrake so we can drift our cars? So yeah, it's pretty wild to see that. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. What are your expectations for Atlanta? We're talking about the track. You know, obviously uh, Vaughn won Atlanta. He's parking and giving the keys over to Adam. You and James are full season. Big flex there. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely. I'm excited for the, the event this weekend. Um, the track has been extended quite a bit, so it's going to be interesting to see that. I feel like Formula D just wants us to free up our cars and slow us down a little bit, and that's how they're going to do it. So I'm ready to accept the challenge and uh, move forward with it and get a win this weekend. I love it. Great positivity. Make some noise for the whole RTR team. Vaughn Jr. What's that? One more group photo? One more team photo of the whole RTR team. Real quick. The car, the people in the back. All right, come on. There we go. Like he's like he's the rock or Kevin Hart or Burt Kreischer. I don't know which one. But hey, hey, right, put your hands up, RTI. Yay! There we go. That's what's up. All right, let's do the wave. That's not We're going back to front, front to back. That's all right. All right. Watch our team photo. Get on over there. Everybody, get on over there. Can't miss Cletus. Cletus, you're out back. Cletus, you get out back, brother. Get, get the pup. Excuse me, can I see your wristband? Puppers. Oh, there it is. All right, my bad. I see it. I see it there on the on the leg. All right. Well, again, thank you to uh, thank you to the venue for having us here. This show's been going on for quite some time, so thank you so much. Everybody, look at Marku. Matt, Matt, hit you, Marku. Don't sneeze. Matt, hit you. Cause inside, Marku. Ooh, I just marked food. <laughs> Maybe Pup won the spoiler. Did Pup win the spoiler? All right, so as you can see, the thing looks great. You know, I love I love what Vaughn did here with these signature lights, right? Because you see everybody kind of knocking them off. There's some aftermarket ones. Obviously, these are aftermarket with some uh, knockoff ones. So the portal, that's what Vaughn's all about, going to the next 
you know, stratosphere, next, you know, uh, next, next universe. So, uh, all right, clear. Are you, what, what do you got going on here, brother? There we go. Okay, she warmed up. She warmed up, Vaughn. So, we're, we're, you know, obviously we can't drift here. We got people in front of us, but uh, uh, you know what? Let's fire up. You guys want to see a burn out? I said, you want to see a burn out? Make some noise! All right, Vaughn, send it in. Let the dog in, baby! Yo! Come on, come on. Let it cook, come on. Grab another gear, Gary. Oh, boy. that? Who did that? Oh, man. Oh, boy. Uh-oh. Tire smoking. Make some noise for Vaughn Ginn Jr. RTR Spec 2. 2024. Vaughn, thank you so much for putting on the festivities. Thank you for contributing. I call my man here the modern day of Carol Shelby, and I think that's a testimonial to his. I know it's big shoes to fill, but you've done a lot in the, in the short amount of time that not only motorsports but, and drifting, but just being a good all-around guy. So thank you for what you do for motorsports and car culture. Thank you very much. Uh, that is an absolute unbelievable honor. I got to spend time with Carol, and he's been a huge inspiration for me. And, uh, you know, I, I, I don't say I'm the next Carol Shelby, but I'm the first me, and I'm really grateful uh, that you all are feeling it and what we're doing. And, you know, for me, this is about this passion about people being inspired to be behind the wheel. You know, we say we're redefining the, the definition of performance. It's not that we're sitting here saying we've got the fastest cars, we've got the best road course car, but I would guarantee you that our definition of performance is encompasses when you walk to the car, when you leave your car, the friends that you meet that you never knew you needed, and every experience that you have when you own an RTR. And all I want to do is inspire and see smiles on everybody's faces, and that's what it's all about. So, much love to you guys. Uh, if you guys have at it, go ahead. If you guys want to do a meet and greet, you know, check out the car, do photos, respect each other's time here with the car, and uh, we'll come back and do a meet and greet in about 30 minutes. Uh, if you guys want to make a line around here, the team will be standing here like this to take photos with you guys. We don't, we're not doing an official autograph session because there's just not enough time to take care of everyone. I don't want to leave anyone hanging. So, uh, yeah, we'll be back in about 30 minutes. Take photos of the car. Enjoy yourself. Hashtag ready to rock. Hashtag ready to reveal. Thanks a lot, you guys. Thank you so, so much. Plug in to your RTR. Thank you so much. DJ. Safety jams. Thank you, Mr. Taylor Swift.